His tendency to call the police and tearfully confess his crimes led the authorities to dub the assailant the weepy-voiced killer. Between the end of 1980 and August 1982, three women were murdered and two others attacked in Minnesota's Minneapolis-St. Paul area. The assaults turned out to be the work of the same man, who contacted the police in a sobbing voice after most of his crimes, begging them to stop him before he killed again. Paul Michael Stephanie targeted women from different social backgrounds and would lure them into his car by offering them a ride. Afterwards, he would take them to a secluded location and kill them. Stephanie would then call 911 and anonymously report the murder he had committed. He was convicted and sentenced to 40 years in 1982. In 1998, he died in prison from cancer. But what drove him to commit these heinous crimes, only to express such emotional remorse afterward?